Cardiovax is a biotech company that was so part of that, like knowing the what does by two one do about basic health. Scientists. I'd started to do some small public health projects in sub-Saharan Africa and South Asia. I began to realize that my real interest was global health, but I didn't have the language and I wasn't confident in what that actually meant. And did I have the right skills as an MD to really be solving global health challenges? And so at that point, I decided that I probably needed a public health degree. For me, the greatest allure of Harvard was the network of people I was going to be able to meet across different sectors. The Dean of the School of Public Health said he was establishing one of his flagship initiatives called the Woman and Health Initiative and he had Professor Anna Langer as a professor of practice coming in. And so I got to work with Anna Langer and establish and develop this incredible initiative which is looking at women's health across the continuum of care, but more importantly, not just looking at women's health, it's women and health. Where do women fit within the provision of health, both as formal providers, because often 100% of the nurses are women, 50% of doctors in the UK are women, but also as informal care providers. When you're a child, you don't call 911 when you fall down in the playground. You go to your mother. It's an incredible initiative, and it was as director of research and development and innovation for that initiative that I would say my skills grew even more. I got a call from Merck for this incredible opportunity called Merck for Mothers, and it's Merck's 10-year, half a billion dollar commitment to reducing maternal mortality. And I can absolutely guarantee you, if I had not done my MPH at Harvard in 2005 to 2006 and continued being on that radar because of my network, I would not be executive director of an incredible initiative like Mother for Mothers. To me, a big part of being at Harvard was realizing the power of getting people from different backgrounds together. Many of the maternal health problems actually require engineers, designers, business expertise in terms of sustainable business models, but also the frontline workers to tell us what is desirable and what's feasible. And those are the people that came to Harvard. And that's the kind of input you need as a public health professional to actually start solving some of these thorny issues.